Yes, praise the Lord. As I stand, praise God. Little David, amen, went up against the giant Goliath. Amen. He picked up five stones, praise the Lord. He put one stone in, that, in the, in the, uh, the sleeve, whatever. And praise God, he swirled that. He said, I come to you in the name of the Lord. And he let go of that rock and hit that giant in the forehead and killed him. Amen. Praise the Lord. That's why I say, you always put your faith and your trust in your God. Your God shall take care of you. There is nothing by any means that will hurt you. Praise the Lord. Hey, it's good to be back. This is part two. Praise the Lord. Of putting your faith in the King James Word. Amen. Praise the Lord. And, you know, something we don't. We don't uh, seek signs. All we seek is God's word. God's word will lead us. God's word will, will guide us. Amen. The word of God. Amen. Jesus said my word is spirit and life. Praise the Lord. We need to get more of his spirit and more of his life in us. The word of God. That's how you increase. Amen. Pray that you be worthy to escape the things that are coming in the past. Praise God Almighty. Amen. Glory to God. You know, we're hearing all kinds of commotions. Glory to God. We hear it every day. Praise God. Tyranny. Tyranny. Tyranny from the government. Tyranny from other people. Praise the Lord. People trying to put the other people in fear. There should only be one fear, my friend. And that's the fear of the Lord. Because that's the beginning of all wisdom and knowledge. Praise the Lord. You better fear the Lord. Don't you fear what man can do to you to be. Amen. Man might be able to destroy your body, but that's all he can do. But praise the Lord, you better fear the one who can destroy your body, both soul. Amen. Glory to God and cast it in hell. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. I'm telling all you Bible believers out there, I'm telling all you chosen people of God, get back to the Word of God. Stay away from heresies. Stay away from other people, uh, scientists. Uh, and, and theologists and, and all those, stay away from them. They'll mess your mind up. You stay in the Word of God. You stay in the Word of God. That's where the peace comes from. That's where my joy comes from. That's where my love comes from. Amen. It's in the pure Word of God. Amen. You'll know somebody who's filled with the Holy Ghost uh, because all you're going to hear is the pure Word of God. Amen. Coming forth out of that vessel and nothing else. Uh, amen. It's not a it's not a, a tyranny. It's not a tyranny, but it's a joy. It's a love. It's a peace. Uh, amen. Glory to God. It's a long suffering and it's patience. Amen. And it builds my faith more and more each day that I read it. Glory to God. Amen. I've got that long suffering. Amen. Glory to God. And I'm as gentle as a bear. Amen. Glory to God. And I'm as kind as the kind can be. Amen. Because God made me that way. God put his word in me and he changed me. Glory to God. And amen. Glory to God. Put all your faith and all your trust in the word of God because that's where it lays in church. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is here with us now. He's with this true church. He's within this true church. Amen. I've been identified, amen, as one of them. Amen. It's going to stand with Noah. I've been identified as one of them. Amen. That will stand with Moses. I've been identified as one of them. Amen. That will stand with Jesus Christ when he was up on the earth. Amen. And I will take all authority in his name. Amen. Because he gave it to me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to read you some scripture in Luke 21. Now look here. Amen. Somebody say amen. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Verse 7. Luke 21, verse 7. And they asked him, Man, Master, but when shall these things be? And what shall sign and what shall the sign will be there be when things shall come to pass? Time seekers. Praise God. Sign seekers. Hallelujah. All right. And he said unto them, Take heed. Ye did not be deceived. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ. And the time draweth near. Go ye not after them. You see? Go ye not after them. You keep yourself in the word of God. You listen and obey Jesus. He's your shepherd. Amen. He said, I am the good shepherd. And my sheep know my voice. 
and I know my sheep, and my sheep are known of mine. Amen. And what's the word of the Father giveth me? Glory to God. No man shall pluck them out of my hand. Hallelujah. Stay with Jesus. Glory to God. But when you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars and commotions, be not terrified. You hear me? Be not terrified. Don't be terrified about this. Praise the Lord. This is all must be, see? For these things must, for these things must first come to pass, but the end is not yet. Then he said, Nation shall rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom, and great earthquakes, for being diverse places, and famine, and pestilences, and fearful signs, and great signs shall there be from heaven. There shall be great signs from heaven. Praise the Lord. The heavens above. Amen. They're talking about these meteorites, uh, this eye sun and all this stuff. Amen. Glory to God. But he told us not to be terrified. He told us not to fear. Praise the Lord. Where is your heart? Where is your faith? Is it in your God's word or is it a man's theologist? Is it in another man's? Amen. Trying to scare you to death. Come on now, somebody. Preach the word. Then he said unto them, Yes, and great earthquake. And then he said, "There, but all before all these, they shall lay their hands uh, on you and persecute you, deliver you up into the synagogue and into prison, being brought before kings and rulers for my name's sake. And I shall turn to you for a testimony. Settle it therefore in your hearts, not to meditate before what you shall answer." He said, "Because I will." Give you a mouth and wisdom which all your adversaries shall not be able to gainsay nor resist. Don't meditate on what you're going to say. Praise the Lord. Amen. Just open your mouth and just be at peace with God, knowing that God is with you. You see, that's the problem of people. They're running to and fro. Seeking other men's opinions. Amen. Glory to God. And seeing what this one believes. And seeing what that one believes. Brother, I'm going to tell you something. You better get on your knees and ask God, amen, to come inside of you. He said, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man will hear my voice, amen, and open the door, amen, I will come into him and sup with him, and he with me. Revelation 3.20, I'm telling you folks, glory to God. Amen. you got to get the Holy Ghost. You must be born again by the water and spirit. Amen. You've got to have Jesus Christ on the inside of you. Amen. Glory to God. He will lead. He will guide you. He will teach you into all truth and all righteousness of his word. Amen. There's a lot of men out there. Amen. The false prophets. Amen. The false Christ, uh, glory to God, and we're running about backbiting, amen, glory to God, and devouring each other. But I want to tell you, my friend, amen, I got one that I can stand with, and his name is Jesus Christ, the righteous, the almighty, the almighty God, amen, he's with me, he's here to protect me, he's going to lead and guide me. I have, oh, I have no ill thing to say about no neighbor of mine, because my love for everybody is the same, amen, glory to God, and my God, amen's love for all is just the same as it is for me or anybody else. Amen. I got to love after God's own heart. Amen. And I cry after my God. Amen. Glory to God. All the thing I worry about is my God. Please, in my God. Amen. Stay on my knees. Amen. And pray. And glory to God. And fasting. Oh, glory to God. Amen. Don't let your heart be terrified. Don't let it be troubled. God's in control. Relax. Praise the Lord. Don't put your faith in scientists of this world. Don't put your faith in the nothing of this world. I'm telling you right now, folks. Uh, don't put your faith in old theologians. Uh, don't put your faith in any, any of uh, whatever, uh, these college field uh, uh, mind masters or psychics or what have you. Lord God, they can't read your heart. Only Christ God, Jesus Christ can. Amen. Glory to God. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Hallelujah. But before all these, they shall lay hands. Yes. And it shall turn to you. All right. For I will give you a mouth and wisdom, and your, your adversaries shall not be able to gainsay nor resist. You look in Isaiah 
54, chapter verse 17. And it says, no, there is no weapon that's formed against us that shall prosper. Amen, glory to God. And every tongue that shall come up against us, glory to God. Amen, glory to God. We got a God. I'm going to tell you something. Brothers, we got a God that will fight our battles. There ain't no weapons, glory to God, that will come against us. And every tongue that shall come against us, amen, we are God's heritage. We are God's people. Amen, glory to God. Are you a child of God? Are you a child that's chosen from the before the foundation of the world? Did he choose you? Was a seed in you, amen, that give you that faith, hallelujah, we are chosen, amen, for his purpose, glory to God, Jesus Christ, the same yesterday, today, and forever, our God, he's real, amen, and he shall protect thee, amen, and this is the heritage of his people, that the Lord, he is our God, and he shall fight our battles, and he will put every tongue to rest, amen, glory to God, put your faith in his word, hallelujah, yes, Amen. Settle up therefore in your hearts. Not to meditate before what you tell us. Amen. And you shall be hated of men for my name's sake. But there shall not one hair of your own head perish. There shall not one hair head of your hair perish. You believe that? That's what Jesus said. I believe it. Amen. That's why I don't I hate. I love God. I trust God. Amen. Oh, Lord Jesus. In your patience, in your patience, possess ye your soul. Yes. Amen. And when you shall, when you shall see Jerusalem compassed with armies, then know that the desolation thereof is nigh. You shall see Jerusalem compass with armies, then know that the desolation thereof is not. And it is, friend. Praise the Lord. Everything right here in this word, this holy word, right here is what you put your faith in, Jesus Christ's word. You don't put your faith in no theology, no scientists, or no nothing in this world. This world is evil. It's evil. The government's evil. Everything in this world is evil. Glory to God. Let's put it in Jesus. Amen. And God's grace is sufficient for you. And in your patience, you will possess your soul if you have the patience to wait upon the Lord. God's going to fight our battles. And he already is. There are things that he's doing now that we don't even see. Praise the Lord. And I believe it. I believe his word. Amen. Glory to the almighty God. Glory to his name, Jesus. Amen. All right, now, I want to stop right there, praise the Lord, and I just want to let you know that I love you, and I thank God for you, but always trust in the Lord, never put your faith in a man. He said, let every man be a liar, and every word of God be true. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. God bless you. I love you. Come on.